A couple of generations of hunters grew up shooting the Browning Auto 5. Great shotgun at its time, but Scott Grange, this looks like an Auto 5, but it's really not. Tom, this is not your granddaddy's Auto 5. And that's a good thing. Okay, it is a good thing. It is a good thing. When Browning discontinued the Auto 5, mm -hmm. as we all knew it, right. the phones lit up. Well, sure, because people, people were love, upset. They loved that They kind. were. They were upset. Yeah. So we felt that someday, in some form, and some fashion, we would come back with an Auto 5 yeah. or an A, in this case, the A5. This is called okay? the A5. This is the A5. Okay. It is a humpback, but it's not exactly the same profile. N not quite. We've, we've lessened the, the profile slightly. Okay. But from a distance, looks the same. Yeah. Okay. And if you're used to that view when you have the gun up to your shoulder, you're going to have that same kind of view right over the top. I know guys that can't shoot anything but. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. My brother's one of them. Right. So we maintained that that sight plane. Okay. Okay. Something else we maintained was the speed load feature. Ah. Okay. Right. That was a John M. Browning design. Only Brownings have it. No other and company say, has What's it. What's it all about? Well, trust me, if you're in a duck blind and you see a bunch of geese coming, that's a really good thing to have. It is. And and, and going through a fence in uh, South Dakota, pheasant hunting, you know, right. and, and the pheasant jumps up the second you get on the other side, speed load. Throw one in. Lots of advantages. Good to, to go. That, exactly. Okay? Other than that, mm -hmm. there's nothing similar to the old Auto 5. I it's thought you were going to say there's nothing changed. There's nothing similar. Yeah, this that's right. This is a new gun. That's right. It is a new gun. Okay. It is a new, new gun. New mechanism, modern. Yes, it is. Now, unlike the old Auto 5, where it was a long recoil operated system where the right. barrel moved three and a half inches rearward and forward, right. this is a more of an inertia type. Uh, system. Okay. Okay. Uh, we've, we've, we've been asked by the consumer, when are you guys going to come out with an inertia system? We've had them in the past in one form or another, right. but we haven't had one for a while. We're, we're the, we've been known as the gas guys. And, and what does an inertia system do for you? Okay. Inertia system in, in a lot of folks' minds is more reliable. I would I would detest that, okay? Right, yeah, because today's gas guns are very reliable. Right. But people people want that, and we sure. listen to the consumer. You give them what they want. Absolutely. Well, if what you have is a reliable gun that feels like a gun that you knew, That's that right. you liked, but you've got some other features. I want to kind of work Absolutely. my way from the back to the front. How's okay. that? Okay. Well, first of all, the Inflex recoil pad. Mm -hmm. That's not just a normal recoil pad that you'd buy down at uh, Walmart and stick on your gun. Okay. Okay. This is a lot of thought went into this. It's got some internal geometry in it that directs the recoil down and out of your face. Oh, okay. okay. Next, we have, your, of course, your, your, your camo pattern, but we offer it with DuraTouch armor coated yeah, finish. And we can't show you how it feels, but trust me, it's soft and just slightly sticky right. to keep it from sliding in your hands. Exactly, especially in cold, wet weather. Okay. Okay, moving forward, we have a spacer system between the receiver and the stock. Give you a little adjustability for the drop at the comb. Okay, All good right. deal. Okay, moving forward, we have a reversible safety, which the old Auto 5 did not have. Right, like okay. that, since I shoot from the left shoulder, I like that. Exactly, yep. exactly. Okay, moving forward, we have what we call the, uh, it's, it's a, a total, barrel concept. It has length and forcing cone in the chamber area, backboard barrel, mm -hmm. and a totally new choke tube system, Tom. Look how long these choke tubes are. This is the hunting tube. This is not your... That's uh, not the target. That's exactly right. Huh. This is called the Invector DS. It stands for double seal. Okay. Uh, it seals rearward. There's a, a patented seal at the, at the rear end mm -hmm. to prevent debris and crud from getting by there and making it very difficult to remove your tube. And then, of course, it seals in the threaded end as well. Sure. Uh, the target version, the extended tube, as you can see, right. is, 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 is uh, very long, uh, has long parallel surfaces in it to stabilize the shot column as it's leaving well, the muzzle. And that's the whole thing. If when you start with a uh, long forcing cone here, then you have an overboard barrel here, and then more parallel on this long choke tube here, you get several things. One, you get reduced recoil, right? and you definitely are not mangling the pellets as they go out, so you have better patterns. Absolutely. So that it works all across the board for and, you. And people might say, well, you're not going to mangle a steel shot pellet anyway. What happens in a tight situation, a tight constriction, right. is you get rebounding effect. Those pellets are rebounding off of each other, which pr produces a, a less than desirable pattern. So there's less uh, inflicted uh, casualty on the, on the shot column as it travels down right. this barrel. The Browning A5 
it is definitely not your grandfather's shotgun. It's better than that. Bolt. Bolt. Browning A5. I mean, your dad hunted with it, your grandpa hunted with it, and now they have a new modern version in camo. You gotta like that. Well, what I like about it, it's very trim and slim feel to it. It's actually pretty light, and we've been shooting hitting clays, no problem. And you know, waterfowling is about nostalgia as much as anything, and to be able to hunt with an A5, a modern A5 like this, just like your dad or your grandpa did, is pretty cool. Pull. Oh.